My name is Dorothea Altschul and I'm the Director of Neurointerventional Neurosurgery at the Valley Hospital. Aneurysm is a bulge on the artery, a weakness if you so will, and with neuroimaging techniques we are now finding aneurysms in people's brains that have not ruptured yet, have not caused any symptoms. There are certain common risk factors um, that can lead to these type of weaknesses. The number one is actually high blood pressure. And secondly, smoking. Going to annual physical exams, I think is really, really critical. There are uh, multiple um, treatments um, that um, you can apply uh, to a brain aneurysm. Coiling has been the first sort of minimal invasive procedure that had been introduced. Going to newer forms of treatment, we actually have a complete set of uh, techniques that we can apply which is, for example, um, flow diverter stents. And what that does is it reroutes the blood away from the aneurysm. The stent gets grown in and the aneurysm goes away that way. The newest one that's on the market and FDA approved is called a web device. This procedure is, is really um, highly advanced and um, it has the incredible advantage that it's much shor shorter because often if an aneurysm is larger, we have to put in multiple coils in and the procedure can get quite long, but with this meshed device, it's like a one-time deployment and it's done. Valley does provide care like no other. We communicate with our patients. We treat them with um, great personalized care all the way along their journey. 